Mike, many congratulations. A really dominant display there to start your campaign. How would you assess your performance? Well, I didn't feel dominant. Um, the first set I was really nervous and got off stage, um, relaxed, got back on stage and I feel much more comfortable. Um, and it showed the, f uh, the second and the third set were a lot better than the first one. So, yeah, I'm really happy to get through. And 9 out of 16 on the doubles, three ton plus finishes. That must give you great confidence going into round two. Yeah, um, you know, every stat is just a stat. Um, it can be, the doubles can be good now and then the next, next game it can be rubbish. Um, so I'm not really looking at stats, I'm just happy with the win. 2023 has been a really positive year for you. You've made a Pro Tour final, qualified for the World Match Play and the World Grand Prix for the first time. Do you feel like you're playing some of the best darts of your career? I've been playing the best darts of my career for the last two, three years, but now the results are coming in. So that's the big difference. And I think for you, it's Madars Razman, the lowest ranked seed in the event. Do you feel that's a real opportunity for you to progress? Yeah, further? of course. Um, if you look at Luke Humphreys, he's in, in top form. If you get him, you're thinking, oh. so number 32 of the seeding list is, is, is a big opportunity. Yeah. Thank you. Mark, do you believe you're the favourite in that game against Manus Rosman? <laughs> uh, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, maybe, uh, I think it's 50-50. Either he wins or I win. So. In terms of your scoring, your scoring power is up there with some of the best in the world. How important is that for you that you give yourself the biggest opportunities against the best players? Yeah, my scoring power is, is where I win games. Um, my scoring power um, gives me multiple opp opportunities on a double. So that's a big, big, big thing in my, my game. You talked about making your debut at some of the big TV events. What's next for you? What's next for you to achieve? I really want to play in the World Cup. Um, representing your country is a big thing. Um, so I really want to get in that one. You have a kin, you and Dimi, is it? Sorry? You and Dimi, do you think it would be? Or you and Ken? Well, I'm not going to catch Dimi in, in the next three, four months, so it's, it's going to be me and Dimitri, hopefully. Hopefully. Mike, you mentioned that you've been playing some good stuff for the past few years, and now the results are starting to come. Is it frustrating now, when you are playing well, that it can take so long to, to start getting... It is, it is, because you see... You shouldn't look at it, but then if you're playing a pro tour and, and you lose first round with a big average or second round and you see other players go through with a lower average than you've been playing, then you think, come on, man, what am I doing wrong? So it's, it's, it's a good feeling that finally some results are coming in. We know that some players don't want like to, to look at their stats, they just look at the form of the, 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 the losses. Are you someone who goes away and looks at your averages and your doubles, how your scoring is? I look at both, like if, if I have a good run with not that good averages or good games then I'm going, well finally it's going my way because if you, if you want to have a deep run in a tournament you need some luck or, or so, <coughs> yeah, it's alright. Yeah. And when you're looking at your stats, is that, can that change how you practice so for example if your finish is not as great you work on that more? No, not really, because um, in in my mind, if you, if you're playing well on a treble, a treble is half as, half the size of a double. So if that's going well, then a double is has to go well as well. And it's been a few wins now on this World Championship stage, but you've never got past the second round. How good would it be to get oh, to that third round? Is very, that <laughs> very. Uh, I, I said it in the interview before. I really hope I can get past Christmas. My huge congratulations. Thank you.